I love my sharks. And I start seeing them coming in with these hooks. The hook removal started like anything would start when you love someone. I just wanted to make their lives a little bit better, to relieve their pain. With Foggy Eye, one day she showed up and she had one that was actually inside. I would open her jaw and see the hook. And then at a certain moment, I decided to basically stick my hand in and I pulled the hook out. But then as soon as she came back, she allowed me to pet her. And from that day on, became a shark that would just show up on the dive. And all of a sudden, I will feel a pressure on my hip and I will turn around and she'll be like leaning into me, just stop swimming. This change of personality from before the hook and after the hook uh, was very much a light bulb for me. When they remove the hooks, I feel happy, satisfied, and relieved. And then the other thing I notice is as I start removing hooks from my known sharks, other sharks will start showing up with hooks. People ask me, do they communicate? And I'm like, Yes, they're very accepting. Sharks in general in the world are very tolerant of our presence entering their world. I wanted to pet a shark from the first moment I saw one. It took a year and some time before the transition between being a diver and then being a professional and I mean, working with sharks and then finally having a shark in my lap. It's understanding that it's done on the shark's terms, not on mine. Because every time a shark does that, I do realize what a privilege it is. This is a wild animal and she's given me full trust. It's a complete abandonment saying, well, in this moment, I trust you. You're not going to hurt me. It is something to be absolutely in awe of, no matter how many times it happens. What I developed is an appreciation for their vulnerability. I've dedicated a lifetime, 26 years, and 25 of those have been spent in the water with sharks. We may still be a little bit afraid of sharks, but we need sharks. The sharks are vital for balancing the ecosystems. And this planet survives on the balance of the oceans. They have been affected by our fishing, by our coastal destruction, by our pollution. This is the um, box of hooks that I've removed uh, through the years. Over 300. I think sharks are absolutely beautiful. I love how they seamlessly swim through the water like my parents taught me, there are no monsters in the sea, only the one we make up in our heads.